The Honda Aircraft Company revealed the new Honda Jet Elite 2 on October 17th at the 2022 National Business Aviation Convention and Exhibition. This new and modern plane is so smart, even if something happens to the pilot, the aircraft can still land itself. Yes, you heard that right. The Honda Jet Elite 2 completes the Honda Jet 420 series in addition to being the newest, shiniest, and best of all of them. Hello and welcome back to our channel. Today in this video, we will look at the newest addition to the Honda Jet 420 series, the new Honda Jet Elite 2. We are here today to share with you everything you need to know about this amazing aircraft, including the cost to own and charter it. Make sure you watch until the end. So, let's get started. Interior The interior features a fully redesigned cabin with two new interior color options, onyx and steel, which give the cabin and cockpit a luxurious look. The Onyx interior is a rich, warm, neutral beige cabin with mid-tone wood accents, while the steel is a light, cool gray theme with high-contrast marble accents. This cabin redesign led to a modern luxury of flight experience with what the team at Honda had called a holistic approach to comfort. This new comfort includes new aisle flooring with hardwood herringbone and plank patterns, a nose-to-tail acoustic treatment to reduce noise for its passengers, and swiveling seats. The lighting system inside the cabin had also received a new upgrade with multicolor LEDs, which also have a soft indigo night setting and ground illumination added to the main entry door and integrated exterior lights. A longer track and sheepskin coverings for the pilot seat are optional features that provide the crew seat an additional 3 inches of space. The cabin has four leather seats and a classic club layout, as well as two stowable executive tables. All of this is complemented with electrically dimmable windows and an optional side-facing fifth seat opposite the entrance, which may also be substituted with a galley kitchen. Just like the Elite S, the Elite 2 offers a unique sound system from Bon Jovi Acoustics, which comprises of 24 powerful transducers incorporated into the sidewalls of the cabin to create a smooth and sophisticated look and offer an immersive sound. This sound system can be managed easily through an app that gives passengers the ability to also darken the cabin through the six electronically dimmable windows. The app also allows its users to change the light colors and the temperature. Both the cabin and the cockpit include many USB ports, allowing passengers and the pilot to charge their electronic devices as needed. There is also satellite connectivity available through Iridium and GoGo -Go Business Aviation's GoGo -Go Biz, which means that everyone on board the aircraft is always connected to the internet, in addition to being able to make and receive phone calls and texts across the entire continental United States and some parts of Canada and Alaska. The lavatory is located at the back of the aircraft and includes a belted seat option to provide an additional legal passenger seat for takeoff and landing. The toilet has two skylights as well as an optional sink with running water that is activated by a motion sensor. Cockpit Inside the cockpit, the Honda Elite 2 features more automation and augmentation, including customized avionics suite based on Garmin's G3000. The system also has auto throttle, which reduces pilot workload via the automation power management through all phases of flight, and it also features the Garmin Autoland system, which is used in emergencies such as pilot blackouts to autonomously control and land the aircraft without human intervention. The auto throttle feature will be available in the first half of 2023, while Autoland will be available in the second half of 2023. The intuitive human-machine interface Honda has integrated offers automated anti-ice, lighting, and pressurization systems to provide convenience and a reduced workload for the pilots. It also has automated ground spoilers to make landing and takeoff as smooth as possible and advanced steering and augmentation systems and a stabilized approach. The last one will monitor the speed and location relative to the programmed approach as the aircraft is approaching the airport. If the approach is deemed unstable, there will be an audio and visual alert to the pilot. Exterior The Elite 2 is black livery with a red side stripe on the outside, giving it a slick and stealth profile. The aircraft includes over-the-wing engine mount configuration, natural laminar flow technology, and a carbon composite fuselage. It will also include ground spoilers to optimize takeoff and landing field performance with the increased weight. The stabilized approach upgrade assists the pilot with oral and visual alerts to maintain a stable aircraft state on approach. Honda has also stated that the jet creates less greenhouse gas emissions and noise pollution than other similarly sized twin-engine business jets. 
This is in line with the company's goal of reaching carbon neutrality by 2050. Performance When it comes to performance, the Elite 2 is powered by the same two GE Honda Aero HF120 turbofan engines with a time between overhauls of 5,000 hours. Each of these engines can produce 2,050 pounds of thrust and this combination is able to push the aircraft to a cruise speed of 422 knots at flight level 300 and up to a cruising altitude of 43,000 feet with an average hourly fuel burn of 90 gallons. The plane can carry 3,100 pounds of fuel, more than the previous 2,900 pounds. Because of its fuel capacity, the Elite 2 has a new NVAA IFR maximum range of 1,547 nautical miles with four passengers, which is 110 nautical miles further than the Elite S. With the added fuel comes an increased gross weight with a maximum takeoff weight of 11,100 pounds. The plane can take off in 3,500 feet with a maximum rate of climb of 4,100 feet per minute, and it has a minimum landing distance of 3,000 feet. Cost to own or charter The base purchase price for the new Elite 2 is $6.59 million before any optional items and features are added. Unfortunately, currently Honda Aircraft is not offering any upgrade from the Elite S to the Elite 2 configuration. Based on the Elite S pricing, the charter price of the new Elite 2 should range between $2,500 and $3,500 per hour. But of course, these prices will vary depending on availability, fuel prices, ground fees, and many other factors. Considering the Elite S, the fixed cost of the new Elite 2 should be roughly $300,000 to $400,000 per year, and the average hourly operating cost is estimated at somewhere between $1,000 and $1,400. The Honda Jet Elite 2 is arguably the fastest, farthest, and highest flying airplane in its class. With all the advancements made to its design and automation, the aircraft boasts superior performance, unparalleled efficiency, and maximized fuselage space, turning its cabin into the largest in its class. The aircraft sets the standard in safety and human-machine interface technology with an ergonomically designed cockpit and highly customized Garmin G3000 avionics suite. Honda Aircraft continues to be committed to improving lives through personal mobility while living in a sustainable society. The Honda Jet Elite 2 remains significantly more fuel efficient with lower greenhouse gas emissions than all other similarly sized twin-engine business jets. Certified for single pilot operations, the Honda Jet Elite 2 continues to live up to the company's reputation for superior performance, efficiency, quality, and value. But what do you think of the new Honda Jet Elite 2 aircraft? What are your favorite design choices when it comes to this plane? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section below. And if you enjoy this type of content, make sure to like, subscribe to our channel, and click the bell icon so that you're notified every time we post something new. Thank you for watching, and we will see you again in our next video.